Okay, here we go again. Rock and Rattle Retreat. Last fall. This fall. Bigger hole there. And we had some tenants actually move into the house after we cleaned it. Good thing we cleaned it when we did. They look happy in there. Got one pair at least, hopefully we get some more. Okay, so we need to get rid of the rock that we blasted out last time. And there's the rock. We got the grapple on. Move the rock into the grapple. Hole. Not light rock. Alrighty. Here is the rock that's in the grapple currently. Did you notice that's not light stuff? So. That's probably what we're going to have in that grapple. But in the meantime, let's move this piece out that was cracked off. At least if we can get it moved out. Nice chunk there. Now nah, it's not going to fit in the grapple. We got enough in there already. And close the grapple up, secure them down, and let's go get put these somewhere where they can be usable. So we have a nice line of rock along this wall or edge of the road around the shed. And that's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna put them in place over here beside the shed. Make a little wall, basically, with them. Let's go get that other piece. And since it's only one piece, let us try to get the grapple to pick it up so we don't actually have to get off the tractor and do it. And we got a good one there. Let's go put this back here. There we go. Just don't run into the shed. And that is still a big rock sitting there. So we're gonna get busy here and drill some holes in that thing and get ready to do some more blasting. So we need the power impact drill. Drill some holes. Now this thing, now we're gonna blow holes out. The power drill seems to drill better when you're not actually forcing the drill bit down, but just kind of let it bounce around a bit. Um, it is a hammer drill, so it's got to do some hammer action. I got a different one, which is much bigger than this, and you can force that one down into it, and it will just go right through it. But these are smaller drill bits, so we're using the spiral one, which is an SPS plus. I'm drilling for this one. And today there's not much wind, so there's a lot of be a lot of smoke on this one. Put these heads together. You've seen this done already. So we're just fast forwarding through it.
put in boosters, put in the heads with the charge. Rocks on top. And then we gotta hook up all of the electrical. There's a camera going up over there. Trying to protect it through the stumps. Put the blanket on, direct this stuff away from us. Hook up all the cords. Turn the cameras on. Boom. A little anticlimactic. Is that the smoke? Here's another view. Here's the best view. Cameras on slow motion. Oh, how'd you like that? And we're gonna do it one more time, uh, slower in the computer uh, program. So you can see each head going off because they don't all go off at the same time. That took a few chunks out. Now I'll show you the cracks in a minute here. Um, the back portion of that did not break apart. Had to uh, get some wedges in there and wedge those top ones off. And I don't show that, sorry. Need to drill down further. That rock is in layers. No. Didn't crack that one. I did crack through and through. So I'm gonna get in here with wedges and drill some holes bigger and wedge it out. Crack it even more and get those pieces out of there. That was all done off camera. So the next time you'll see this, those are gone. I think they went off. Okay. Everything went off. But it just... And it just... The experimental ones, one did, one didn't. Some of that yeah. stuff and they got blew out the bottom of that rock. Here's the next day. It's windier than we've already drilled okay. the holes. A little windy today. We got three holes done. One, two, three. And what we're gonna do today is pour some water down. These will work underwater, so they say. Whether I can get this bottle off is another matter. water is supposed to help crack because it takes the air out of the equation and the air compresses and the water doesn't. What I should have really done was pour some in, put the charges in and then pour some more water in to take the air out of the equation. Water in, booster, 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 and then
Okay, let's hook up the rest and I'll get in later. Okay, get the blanket on, get all the cables up. like much there did it let's go to the big camera oh you can see it come below there some of that stuff came on un underneath between the rocks here's the super slow see it came out underneath Pull these things out of there. They're tight. All right, what do we got? And this one cracked all the way up and back. That one cracked. That one didn't look like it did anything. But that one blasted up underneath that other rock. So we drilled three more holes. Two on top between the two holes. And two on the side. And the wind didn't blew that thing right off. And that's why I put a rock on top of that one. Keeps it in. Here's another view. Oh! And the rock slid off with the blanket. I'm back there hooking stuff up and realized, no, it's already halfway hooked up. Let's just hook the rest of it up and blow it and see what happens. Uh, I should have unhooked it, went, put a rock back on top, but I wanted to see what was going to happen. Plug it in the generator and... Boom. That one head just flew right off of there. Doesn't mean it didn't do anything. And on super slow motion, look at this one right here in the bottom. Let's put it in sideways. Look at all the dirt that flies up. So it blew partially out of the bottom and some of the dirt took the impact. See what we got. That one, and another crack. Mm -hmm. That one got a crack, and a crack, That's and cracked crack all there. the way crack through. Wasn't there. And this one blew out a lot of dirt, but it got still a bit of a got crack some crack. In there. Yeah. So I think we can probably leave that. So we're going to leave the rocks right there. We're going to pull the heads, put everything away. Right. And when I come back up next time, I will take care of that rock. See if I can pry it loose. If I had a bigger machine, it wouldn't be any problem from the first time I blew it. So here's the winter show of the property. This is what happened at the end of the last time we were up there. Couldn't fly the drone this time. It was a bit windy to do that. Here comes that rock up in the lower left corner. That's the one we're working on. And it was, you know, a little bit one day and the morning of the next day. And here's our view. We're going to take a few of these trees down yet. But let's get the house up. Still waiting for the excavator to come in to rip out the stumps and dig a foundation. Here's the winter view. 
Thanks for watching. Subscribe, comment. Doing any of that doesn't cost you any money, and it helps the channel. See you later.